what exactly is Data Protection Manager? Data Protection Manager allows me to back up resources. Simple as that. I can back up um, data. I can back up the Exchange servers, SQL servers, SharePoint. I can back up Windows servers, virtual machines. I can either put them to disk, or in your book they, they said, or take, and to Windows Azure. It's a typo. You can back them up to disk. You can back them up to tape. You can back them up to Windows Azure if you want. Now, there's two important points that we have. We have the recovery point objective and the recovery time objective. The recovery point objective is how much data we're allowed to lose. So if I need to not lose any more than two hours worth of data, I'm going to have to do backups at least every two hours. If I want to lose uh, you know, no more than uh, 10 minutes worth of data, well, I'm going to have to do backups every 10 minutes. So that is your recovery point objective. Also, you have to look at the recovery time objective is how much time am I allowed to take to bring this machine back up. And if they say it's got to be uh, no more than an hour, that means my recovery point objective is going to have to be able to be reinstalled or uh, restored within that hour. So if I have ginormous backups, woo, these are so big, what I may need to do is speed up the backup so it's smaller chunks. That way I can recover with a smaller restoration. So uh, the recovery point objective is how much data can we lose? How often do I have to do backups? Recovery time objective is how long I can take to actually do the recovery. 